What is up, my Moon Tribe? I am Haley. Welcome back to Moon Tribe Tarot. This is going to be for the star sign of Scorpio for February 7th to the 14th of February 2021. Take what resonates and leave behind what does not. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me where your messages will 100% correlate to yours because they are for you in mind, you can find all the information, how to reach me for a reading, in the description box down below. If you like the content that I make and you'd like to support my ass, please go smash the like and subscribe buttons. Without any further ado, I've already gone and pulled your cards off camera for you like always, Scorpio, so let's get right into the reading. We got Major Icon the Temperance, Page of Wands, Outcome Major Arcana, the Hermit. Okay, so with the Major Arcana Temperance, well, we have a Major Arcana, it represents major life events, major lessons on a path to self-exploration. Um, the Temperance card represents moderation, ebb and flow. It represents patience, and it also represents healing over a longer span of time, as opposed to the Star card, where it's just like, boom, right in your face. Like, here's healing. This happens over a broader, sp uh, or a more broad span of time. Um, it really represents alchemy, patience, and honestly, mostly just patience. It, it's having the ability to calmly and smoothly um, manage something in a peaceful, peaceful manner. Um, where things might be, I'm getting the, the, the feeling that things might be hectic right now, which is what requires you to kind of mend things together, but it is healing over a larger period of time. Now, I definitely get the feeling that you are moving away from a negative period of time because following the Temperance card, we have the Page of Wands, who is the most eager, enthusiastic page in the damn deck. He represents happiness, that there are adventures to be had. It represents a good period of time um, where basically the, the feeling for this is what's wands so it represents either getting a new job um, starting out a new relationship um, literally just exploring your situations not your situations your environment going hiking traveling this is eager enthusiastic news so when I get temperance with the page of wands it's either saying that you are tempering things and you are mo you are um, restoring balance in your life by pursuing these things that make you happy these new things that make you happy or it's just saying that you've been healing and now there comes success from that now the outcome we're still in our head a little bit with the major icon of the the hermit because we got two major iconas. This is a larger um, reading because there's two major iconas in this, making it a major reading. Um, so this is just a, it, it's kind of just uh, the importance of this reading is saying that it's significant to you in your life right now. This is large. Um, the Hermit represents isolation, introspection, and seeking the answers for yourself, inside of yourself. It represents that these aren't really things that you can go out and ask other people. You have to do this yourself. You have to grow for yourself to figure out what it is that you need because other people aren't going to be uh, able to tell you what it is that you need, what, what person you need to make you happy in a relationship, or what you need to do to make your own self happy, because everybody else isn't you, you're your own person, and it's your own subjective story. Um, but this isn't... <clears throat> The hermit can represent actual feelings of loneliness, but this is, I'm hearing that it's a good thing for you. I'm also hearing that this is something that uh, I think you've been doing, but I think that you are, it's just so you know, this isn't like, um, it's not a bad thing where sometimes you get the hermit and it's like, oh no, like we're, we're hermiting ourselves in. <clears throat> this is actually still on your progress. Uh, this is still on your path of progress, of healing. This is one of the steps. It's I'm being told very specifically that this isn't like separate from this. Nothing happens to make you... It's not like the Page of Wands goes awry and he finds that, oh, this isn't like working out for him. That's not what it's saying. It's saying that part of... Um, the eagerness and enthusiasm of traveling outwards is also innately exploring yourself deeply. It's It's taking time to be alone to take yourself out on dates, to take yourself out or to meditate or just to relax or just to kind of shut the world off and only focus on you, which I think that you might not be 100% comfortable with. But with temperance, it's saying that this is something that you are learning. And part of the learning process is learning what do I need to do and finding those answers with inside of yourself. Honestly, Scorpio, I don't really need to pull for clarity because I got the full answer here. Um, this is a self-improvement spread, and it's saying that you're doing a good job. You are definitely doing a good job, and it will be productive for you. Don't look at this card and be like, 
like, oh my god, I'm gonna be alone. That's not what this means here. I, I really get this as self-improvement and what you need to do to make yourself better. Um, this is going to be a large period of time for you, Scorpio, so buckle up and enjoy the ride because there's a lot of self-discovery to be had here. I love you very much, and I will see you on the flip side. Peace out, my moon tribe.